It's the possibility of having a dream come true that makes life interesting. A quote from the book, The Alchemist. It speaks volumes about our protagonist, Santiago, a young Andalusian shepherd. Santiago's life takes an unexpected turn when he experiences a recurring dream. A dream where a child urges him to seek treasure at the foot of the Egyptian pyramids. This dream, recurring and persistent, is a call to adventure that Santiago cannot ignore. It promises the allure of treasure, the excitement of discovery, and the fulfillment of curiosity. Santiago, filled with the spirit of a true adventurer, decides to heed this call. He chooses to follow this dream, his own personal legend. This choice sets his life on a path that is as exciting as it is unpredictable. Santiago's story begins with a dream, but it is his decision to follow that dream that truly starts his journey. And so, driven by his vision, Santiago embarks on a quest to fulfill his personal legend. When Santiago meets the mysterious Melchizedek, his journey truly begins. In the heart of the Spanish countryside, Santiago crosses paths with this enigmatic figure. Dressed in a cloak of many colors, Melchizedek presents himself as the King of Salem. His presence is as fascinating as it is perplexing. He is a mentor wrapped in riddles, a guiding light shrouded in shadows. Melchizedek's wisdom is not freely given, it's earned, and it becomes the compass that Santiago needs to navigate his destiny. In their encounter, Melchizedek reveals the concept of a personal legend, a unique purpose that each individual is destined to fulfill. He tells Santiago that the recurring dream of the Egyptian pyramids is a sign, a call to action. It's Santiago's personal legend urging him to venture forth into the unknown. The pyramids, they're not just a destination, they are a symbol of Santiago's destiny. One of the key lessons Santiago learns from Melchizedek is the importance of seizing the moment, of taking the plunge when life presents an opportunity. This is encapsulated in the old king's words, when you want something, all the universe conspires in helping you to achieve it. It's a profound statement, one that Santiago takes to heart. It strengthens his resolve to sell his flock and set off to Tangier, despite the uncertainty and the risks. Another valuable lesson Santiago learns from Melchizedek is the significance of resilience. The King of Salem warns him that he will face many challenges along his journey. These obstacles, however, are not meant to deter him, but to test his resolve, to forge his character in the crucible of trials and tribulations. The encounter with Melchizedek serves as a turning point in Santiago's life. It sets him on the path of self-discovery and the pursuit of his personal legend. It's an enlightening experience that prepares him for the journey ahead, equipping him with the wisdom and courage to face the challenges that lie in wait. With Melchizedek's words in his heart, Santiago sets off to Tangier, where the real adventure begins. In the vast Sahara Desert, Santiago encounters love and the secrets of alchemy. Here, amidst the shifting sands, he meets Fatima, a desert girl with eyes like the desert sky, and his heart is forever altered. Love, he learns, is a force as potent and transformative as any alchemical creation. As Santiago's bond with Fatima deepens, so too does his understanding of the world. The desert, seemingly barren and lifeless, is alive with stories and secrets. It whispers tales of love and loss, of dreams pursued and abandoned, teaching Santiago that every grain of sand holds a piece of the world's history, and every gust of wind carries a tale yet untold. In the heart of the desert, Santiago also crosses paths with an Englishman, a scholar of alchemy. This encounter guides Santiago to the secrets of the Emerald Tablet and the ultimate alchemical creation, the Philosopher's Stone and the Elixir of Life. He learns that alchemy isn't just about turning lead into gold, it's about understanding the language of the world, recognizing the oneness of all things. The Englishman tells Santiago of the Philosopher's Stone, capable of transforming any metal into gold, and the elixir of life, which confers immortality. Yet the true power of these creations isn't their literal transformation, but their symbolic significance. They represent the potential for change, for transformation, for realizing one's personal legend. Through Fatima, Santiago experiences the transformative power of love. Through the Englishman, he discovers the transformative power of knowledge. Both encounters illuminate his path, guiding him towards his destiny. The desert, love, and alchemy, each present Santiago with challenges and gifts, shaping him, guiding him, propelling him forward on his quest. Each encounter is a step closer to understanding the language of the world, to realizing his personal legend, to uncovering the treasure he seeks. Armed with newfound knowledge and love in his heart, Santiago inches closer to the pyramids and his dream. 
love, alchemy, and the desert. They are not just parts of Santiago's journey but integral chapters in his story of self-discovery and the pursuit of destiny. As Santiago nears his destination danger lurks. The pyramids, so long a beacon of hope and promise now cast long shadows of uncertainty and peril. Yet, Santiago, our young Andalusian shepherd turned dream seeker does not falter. He is captured by Arab soldiers, a menacing wall of hostility and mistrust. The desert, once a testament to the grandeur of nature and the limitless expanse of the soul, now seems nothing more than a cruel trap. Santiago, far from his home, his flock, and the familiar comfort of his shepherd life, is tested to his limits. But his spirit remains unbroken. His courage is not the loud brash kind that shouts from rooftops. No, it's the quiet, relentless sort that whispers in the dead of night, echoing along the windswept dunes. It's the courage of a single step taken in the face of a thousand-mile journey. It's the courage of holding onto a dream when reality threatens to shatter it into a million pieces. This same courage fuels Santiago's determination. He doesn't just endure his trials, he confronts them. He doesn't merely survive, he prevails. Santiago's strength lies not in his physical prowess, but in his unyielding spirit, his unwavering faith in his personal legend. There's a lesson for us all here, nestled amidst the sands of Santiago's story. It's a reminder that the path to our dreams is seldom easy, often fraught with challenges that test our spirit, our faith, our very resolve. But it's during these trials that we discover our true strength, our true selves. Santiago's journey, his trials, his triumphs, they're more than just a shepherd's tale. They're a testament to the power of dreams, the importance of perseverance, and the incredible strength of the human spirit. Despite the danger and uncertainty, Santiago continues to pursue his dream, demonstrating the power of persistence and faith. His story serves as a beacon, guiding us all towards the realization of our own personal legends. In the end, Santiago discovers that the greatest treasures are not always hidden in earthly riches. As our shepherd-turned-explorer arrives at the Egyptian pyramids, he finds no physical treasure. Instead, he uncovers a wealth far greater. The understanding that the true treasure lies within his heart, in the journey he undertook, the lessons he learned, and the path he chose to follow. What Santiago's journey through the pages of The Alchemist teaches us, is that our dreams, our self-discovery, and the relentless pursuit of our destiny, are the real treasures. Santiago's quest for worldly riches was merely a vehicle that led him to the profound realization of the importance of internal wealth. The greatest treasures aren't always tangible nor can they be measured by worldly standards. Sometimes the greatest treasures are the ones we carry within us. And with that, Santiago's journey comes to an end. Thank you for joining Santiago on his journey. It's been a tale of courage, resilience, and self-discovery. If Santiago's story resonated with you, if it inspired you to look within and realize the value of the treasures you carry within you, please show your appreciation by hitting the like button. Your support means the world to us and helps us bring more such inspiring stories to you. Want to continue exploring the world of literature, myths, and timeless wisdom? Then make sure to subscribe to our channel. By subscribing you become a part of a community of curious minds, of dreamers and doers, of seekers and explorers. Join us as we delve into the depths of human potential and unearth the treasures hidden within stories. And don't forget to hit the bell icon to turn on notifications. By doing so, you ensure that you never miss a video from us. Each video is a new journey, a new exploration, a new treasure hunt. Don't miss out. Until next time, remember Santiago's journey. Remember the alchemist's wisdom. Keep chasing your personal legend. Because who knows? Your greatest treasure might just be waiting for you to discover it. Goodbye for now, and keep exploring.